If you visit Mitchell Park in San Luis Obispo, you may have noticed music near the playground. It's all part of a city pilot program aimed at making the park more welcoming to families and kids. Not everyone, though, is happy about it. KSPY's Kimberly Cruz explains. Typically with my movement, the music would be activated. However, right now there isn't any music playing. I did ask the city why that is, but they couldn't give me an answer. However, I did speak with one person who has heard the music before. The idea to have music playing at Mitchell Park's playground was brought forth by San Luis Obispo City Manager Derek Johnson. So we know that music helps kids learn. You know, we know that music helps families have a good time. And so if we can create some ambiance and really set the stage so that people know that the playground and the surrounding park is there for families and kids. Due to copyright laws, we can't play the music for you. Really kids and, and family music. So, you know, things like Wheel on the Bus, you know, those, those big hits, um, and, and, it's, and we deliberately picked that music and selected that music because we want the music to really reflect the environment that we're trying to uh, create out there. I did hear part of one song on the playlist. It featured upbeat dance pop music with repeated chicken sounds. You know, we've gotten some initial feedback. Some of the parents really love it. You know, it really provides some joy to kids and families. Not everyone visiting the playground is a fan. That's what we have to listen to. Jamie Campbell is part of that group. It was terrible. Uh, it was, I came one day and there was just this horrible music playing. It wasn't exactly kids music. It was like kids music on acid that you'd like hear at a rave. It was just terrible. But on Friday, just the sounds of birds chirping and nearby traffic filled the air. I'm so glad it's not playing anymore. I like that it's peaceful. It gives them that two seconds to just de-stress. Caballero says although he never heard the music, as a parent, he prefers the quiet. I mean, here they can play, they can scream, they can do whatever they want to, and they're not just being bombarded by sound all the time. And like you walk into stores and you get music, you walk in a doctor's office, there's music, you get in your car, you go home just constantly hearing things. City officials say the target area is only Mitchell Park, as it's the only park in the downtown area with a playground and a restroom where the speakers are located. We know from research that um, kids learn with, uh, with music and they're in their development stages and so if they can have some music that accompanies their outside play on that playground all the better. When the music is playing it plays from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. Now I did ask the city manager if he thinks the music is going to push the homeless population that typically stays at the park and he said he doesn't know. In San Luis Obispo, Kimberly Cruz, KSBY News.